Hi hey guys, Tix Park here. It, uh, with the part two of uh, start, well, part two of that. Um, just showing you the progress I've made so far. Uh, I've been doing some, uh, basically mainly getting the body together and getting the seals and stuff done. He's in this cell, uh, basically done. Uh, some cleaning up I need to do. It's all together basically. All I need to do is mask off some, mask off the uh, where the blue and that stuff is, and then paint the body. Everything's in place. It's easy. And it's it's got a little bit of weight to it. It's not really heavy, but it's got some weight to it anyway. Uh, that cap down there. I've got some. If you got jets like that, models. Got some of this model filler. Can you use, uh, be careful, you have to use gloves for this and a mask because it's very toxic and it can damage your skin. Use this, it's like I think it's like uh, probably like car body filler. You just fill in the gap there and you sand it smooth and it'll get rid of that gap all the way down there. Uh, I try to fit it as much as I can, it just won't fit at all. Probably something to do in the factory where the, the uh, mould shrinks. But I've, I've closed up that end as far as I could. But as you can see it goes all the way up like that. And but everything is fine. The best thing about the, the body is if you get glue or on it, it's going to be painted and sand, sanded and painted anyway. So yeah, this in the cell is a Puzzard Collector. You can feel, I know it's a bit poor paint in there, but I mean, we need to let up. Just see, there's a vinyl inside there to simulate the fans, just inside there. So yeah, um, little body up at the moment. Yeah, just glued it up again with all the gaps. I'm filling them all in again. Um, rubber bands, good tip. That's a really good tip is to put rubber bands around it. Tying it together uh, instead of using tape because tape uses, leaves a residue, rubber bands don't. And if you get glue on it, still you just cut the rubber bands off. Simple. It's back in the bit there. I haven't finished the front end bit, but yeah, got all the details done. You didn't know, but there's actually a window piece underneath the, the, the ship there, which I didn't really know. Um, Oh, here's, here's the buzzer collector. You can just see inside there that fan thing. Um, there's a hole in there which makes me think that you could put a motor inside that and a fan in order to, uh, and the lights just to put it up. I'll probably do that in the future, but at the moment it's just going to be playing. There's the other this I haven't finished yet. Soft section. Here it is. It's all done glued together, it just needs painting now. Uh, you've got the bridge there. Let's see. Cool. Uh, forget about that stain, it's paint said try clean up. We've got the impulse engines at the back. You put the art impulse engine, I don't know if it's engines. Underneath you got this thing there, so um it's just one thing that um on the vinyl sheet it doesn't come with it oh I'm so shy. It doesn't come with any Aztec sheeting. But if you look at the instructions, there, yeah, Aztec sheeting, and it's asked you to paint that yourself. And I know I like model making, but there's no way I'm staying there. And unless I had a, a, a template, it didn't come with a template or anything, and it's just no. Nothing else is on for I'm not going to do all that detail in there. It's like drawing bricks, you just can't, it's, it's going to take ages. And I'm not that patient. And then there's the other strut there, so. Don't forget to uh, watch part two when I'm hopefully I'll have it all finished. Um, if you haven't watched part one, watch part one. Uh, unless you just want to see the finished product. So, yeah. Uh, the paints I'm using is the. Uh, well, it's those. They're the paints I'm using. Oh, another tip as well. If you get some clear uh, 
glass coat like this, or you can map, map coat if you want to. Um, when you put the, the uh, vinyls on, instead of so when it rubs off, put a coat of this over it, and should dry, and it should stop it from peeling off. I didn't do that to the Voyager one, and the stickers and vinyls are peeling off. So get this. You don't use any of them. So don't forget to watch part one. Like I said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Watch out for part three. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.